everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing some art from George Orwell's 1984 book. And uh, my artistic skills aren't very much out there yet. Uh, so a lot of the ideas that I was thinking of aren't going to be uh, feasible. So I kind of got fully creative with it. And I'll take you guys along the journey. Hopefully you guys can still tell what it is. And yeah, let's see what we can come up with. So I thought um, these are just like some doodles I was thinking of uh, while I was off camera. I also kind of made these over here but you can't see them because they're off camera there you go but it's also upside down so i got an idea of what we could do now okay so i'm just right now like laying out my color palette i've got my drawing set up and uh, i'm using the artist loft master such i mean the master such fine art studio brand the husband got them for me for christmas and i'm all excited to finally try them out so what i drew here is the sky um that would probably be like a futuristic version of a citizen or what they call the people in George Orwell's book, uh, Comrade. And uh, they have these things called tele screens and they are constantly watching you. You can never turn them off. You can only lower the volume oh so much, but you can never uh, lower the volume completely. And so they're constantly watching you to make sure you're not committing any crimes, especially thought crimes which uh it's just what it sounds like you can be arrested even on the suspicion of like a crime whether or not like the person can approve it it's just like oh well i think this person is doing this and it just does not fit the norms of society so off to jail you go and i feel like it's reminiscent of today's uh, society because you know um we seem to be in a society where like we think that just because we disagree with somebody that they're our enemy when um, you know, I don't think it should be that case. I think we should show a little bit more love to our fellow people, especially like in this day and age. You know, with the whole coronavirus going on. Yeah, right. So yeah, so the tele screen I do is like the eye because like it's constantly watching you in ears for like three percent that is constantly being listened to. Obviously, my drawing isn't that like great right now because I really don't know much about human anatomy, so. <laughs> Like, it looks like his waist, like, stops here, so he's got, like, no chest. Um, yes, so that's where we're at. And they, the uniforms that the people wear in the society are blue overalls. They don't really wear anything else. That's pretty much their only uniform. And, uh, they're not really giving anything else to wear. I've been up to, uh, increasing my knowledge using Skillshare which is not affiliated and not sponsored. But I thought you guys might want to know about it because it's a really cool website. I'm pretty sure all of you know what it is by now, but for those of you who don't, it's this online learning community where you can learn about anything from graphic design to watercolors to um, uh, cooking. Pretty much anything you want to learn, like it's gonna be there. Why am I using my tiniest brush? I just noticed that. I was like, why is it taking forever? It's because I'm using my tiniest brush. That's why. Who would have thought?
we are almost done. Okay, I think there's a few more things to add now. I'm gonna get out my, my comms for this. Thank you.